I want a bottle of vodka, Mr. Patel. I want to see some ID. <laughs> You're a hard man, Mr. Patel. <laughs> no ID, no alcohol. You seen it? You seen hey. this? Refusing me drink because I'm white? Well, that's discrimination. Aye. I think you should call the police. I'll call the police. Before you do. Hey, come on. So, this is my living. Put that back! Hey! You won't get away with this. That's <laughs> being a racialist. Cheers now. <laughs> Where's the paper cups? Oh, are you weird? Davina, happy in your new job? Yes, thanks. Uh, we've had a phone call from a Mr Patel, the local shop. Right. Uh, could we meet up later, Roger? Say, last period? Sure. Uh, Jack. We've got a gang of our ex-pupils terrorising the local shopkeeper. I've got to get down there. You want to use my car? I want you to come with me. This is my PPA time. You're the disciplinarian. Jack, I need your backup. I think Lewis Seddon's involved. They're no longer with us, Mr. Patel. I Waterloo Road. What do you mean? Half of them are little kids. They've been excluded. Half the school's been excluded. Now they run riot on the estate. My business, it's ruined. You know how much for security? Eight thousand pounds a year. Cameras and alarms and insurance. And you two, you just wash your hands. Not your problem. Have you tried calling the police? If the police could help, why is he a prisoner in his own shop? They slash your tyres. Train your children, your wife. I'm sick of it. No one can run a business here now. The exclusion policy. We're going to have to rethink it. Oh, when it's working so well. It's causing havoc out there. The system can't deal with all these feral children just dumped on them. Yeah, and one school can't deal with them all either, Andrew, like you said yourself. And I'm only interested in this one school. Yes, I know, but... Look, I'm telling you, this time next year, we'll have them queuing round the block to get their kids in here. We will get the support of this community. should be and you. Kim, you've you... just turned this whole community upside down with your big stick theories and for what? Hey, to show us all how tough you are or to pander to his gigantic ego. Kim! Just look out of the window. We are the enemy now, Andrew. Do you know what? It was bad enough when it was you on your own. Now you've teamed up with that moron. What a mess. Yep. Oh, thank 
God, the man in charge is here. You know, one good thing about them not having mobile phones is that they can't take a picture and send it to the local paper. Leave me alone, you! Imagine what they'd make of this. Right, come on, break it up now. We have to have a disciplinary. Inside, please!